Hi Aries, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your reading now. I am doing your reading for the end of October. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is the Vice Versa deck. This card is what was on top. Okay, so I ended my last reading and I have come to the conclusion that the card that is on top is meant for the next person. The next reading, it's the way it always works out. It is, there's a history behind it and that I have come to accept okay um, so it looks as though you guys may have a tower moment you may have something some sort of event or upheaval or rude awakening that comes about that is happening to change your life when the tower moment comes out it comes out because a change is needed something needs to break down so that you can go in a new direction so it looks as though you may have some sort of event that comes about that changes your path. Because where you're at, there's been no growth. Okay, There's been no growth, there's been no expansion. And you may need this upheaval to push you in that new direction. Aries, what does Aries need to know? Something is is breaking down to wake you up. Maybe a little emotional. Maybe you need to come out of your shell. Maybe you guys have been feeling a little withdrawn and depressed and going through something internally that needs to be dealt with. Mm. We have the lovers. So there's an unexpected change here. You're going to have to make a decision, right? Now, typically my readings are love readings, so we're going to see whatever comes up. But looks like there's some sort of soulmate connection here that may be coming to you. Maybe maybe you don't see it. Or maybe you don't realize it. Maybe this is, a, this is quite unexpected. Maybe you're not even looking for it. Um, and here it is. Here it is. I get the chills. That means that what I'm saying is probably right. Destiny and fate. Holy shit. Some sort of fated change is on the horizon. You may have some sort of reunion with a soulmate. Maybe you don't even know this who this soulmate is. And because this is not who you think it is. Okay, it's not who you think it is. So there could be some sort of coming together of two people that you truly don't expect to happen. There's some, there's some sort of destined change on the horizon that is going to bring you something better. And it's going to bring you down a new road, okay? This is just is a change, of course. And it, it's, gonna, it's, gonna, it's not what you think it is, okay? You can't determine what this is. This is unexpected. It's meant to be unexpected so that you can't... It's like you can't prepare for this. Because when you prepare for it, you don't experience the way that you're supposed to experience it, okay? Something is going to happen very unexpectedly, there's no doubt. There's going to be an, un this is unexpected, this is unexpected, and this is probably unexpected as well. There's an unexpected happening that suddenly changes your direction. It may make you come out of your shell, because see, turtles are usually in their shell. Quite often they're in their shell. So it may take you right out of your shell. Interesting. We have the King of Swords. This is about making a decision. And you are going to have to make some sort of decision, okay? Because the, the Lover's card is a decision. Taking charge. Taking, it, making, taking a stand of some sort. Firm, very firm, solid decision. You're gonna, yeah, you're gonna have to stand firm. That's for damn sure. You are. Four of Cups. Oh, the hair font. Justice reserve and <laughs> justice with but 
We're just gonna, it's gonna happen quick. The goosebumps are here like friggin' crazy in the Three of Cups. Oh my God. It's like, they're my, I wish you could see the chills on my arms. They've been coming from almost all my readings. Um, wow. So Aries, it looks as though there's some sort of Hmm. happening that's going to happen very, 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 very quickly, okay? There's some sort of forward movement. Something's moving you in a direction like at lightning speed, okay? So some, there's going to be a sudden change, all right? And then there's going to be a celebration at the end of it. At the end of it, there's going to be some sort of celebration. It's going to be a gift. It is. You're going to see it as a gift. This justice right here, you notice the sword is... The sword of truth is, is not even being used. The scales of, of truth are on the ground. Something has been really unjust. Okay, there's been a, a situation that you have been in that has been... You haven't been getting the justice that you deserve, put it that way. And it feels like you've probably given up. You've probably given up on, on receiving this justice, right? You've been in a one-sided situation. We got one scale here, and then we have, this doesn't even make sense. He must be, we, we, you've been involved in a one-sided situation. And now it's time for you to get your, get some help, it looks like. It looks like you're going to receive some sort of help. Because you've been in a one-sided situation. You have. I think they're bringing you together with a soulmate after you've been on your own for quite some time. Whether you've been in a relationship that was one-sided or not. They're bringing you somebody in to connect with you. Um, this Four of Cups is, is an opportunity. It's like the ship. It's like you're letting it go. It's like you don't want this opportunity anymore. You're letting something wash away. It's like, I don't want this anymore. And the universe, probably because of the towers, the universe card, the universe sees that you have given up hope. It sees that you have given up the fight. You're no longer wanting to hold on anymore. It's like you're surrendering to the universe. Ready to follow your own path, believing, listening to your inner guide. And the universe is asking you to have faith at this time. So if you don't have faith, I'm here to tell you to have faith. I think that you are receiving some sort of divine guidance from above you may not see it you may not see it you may not hear it but I think that they are bringing you some sort of new opportunity because you have been in you've been in a situation that was one-sided and you you deserve happiness this three of cups is a celebration after some sort of upheaval I think there's some sort of new union coming in, and I know I'm repeating myself, but there is. There's a union coming about that you absolutely, positively don't expect. This is not who you think it is. It's not. It's not. There's no way that you can... This is something that is unknown, okay? It's unknown. You are, you are destined for a change of course that is going to... 
make you very, very happy. It is. I mean, this is basically the justice reversed. You have been in a situation where there was no justice. It was one-sided. But because you have kept the faith and believed in yourself and followed your own path, it's like the universe says, boom. The time is now for this change. The time is now for your good fortune. Are you strong enough to go through with it? You don't have a choice anyway with the universe. You don't have a choice. With this, I always call the tower the universe. With the tower, you don't have a choice. This king of swords, this is very... Oh, taking the lead. Leadership, authority. Power. It's going to give, this is going to give you some sort of power. It's like the universe is giving you the power to, to accept this change. You are, you are going to go through a massive change. Your course is about to change drastically. That's what I see. And in the end, it's going to make you really, really, really happy. It's what you've been wishing for. Aries is letting an opportunity go. I don't want this opportunity. You're letting something go. Believing, trusting. This is faith and trust. Yeah, you guys have been carrying around something that needs to be released. It's killing you. The universe sees it. The universe sees that you are, won't drop it. You won't let something go that needs to go. You don't even realize that you're on your own. You know, maybe you do. Maybe you do. There's help available, but you're not letting anybody help you. It's like you're ready to go. You're ready, you're ready to just die carrying this load whatever it is because you see he this is him he's turned to stone he doesn't even see it he's alone he doesn't have anybody with him he's grown old and he's turned to stone alone carrying this heavy load The universe is going to bring you somebody to help you. You're not alone. You're not supposed to be alone. is the four of pentacles obsession resisting change you've been resisting this for so long why why you guys resist help from others resisting a change resisting letting go of something that doesn't serve you anymore this why are you resisting letting go? The King of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You're dealing with a person that is withdrawn and cold. Keeps to themselves. It's like they're not opening their heart to you. 
They're keeping their love to themselves. They're not offering it to you. They're keeping it to themselves. And that's why you're destined for this change because you deserve to be loved. You don't deserve to be in a one-sided situation. You need to be logical here. It's like you guys are about to reunite with somebody who you're meant to be with because you have been involved or you have been involved in a situation that was one-sided and you deserve so much more than that. Woo! Wow. Yeah. It's like you guys are finding the courage. You're going to have to find the courage to move in a new direction. Quickly. I think you guys are quickly being pushed out of a situation that, because see it's right here, that gives you back your power that's been lost by a situation that was one-sided. I think that you guys are getting your power back. It's being put right in your hand. It's like the universe is really going to force you to drop this load, to cut something out quickly, very quickly. They're giving you the support that you need. Wow. Something is happening very quickly. No, have no fear. Have no fear. You may need to defend yourself. And maybe you feel like you need to defend yourself. Maybe you do need to defend. You may need to defend yourself. Okay. There's going to be some sort of destined, fated event that puts the sword right in your hand. The sword of truth, the sword of power, the sword of change, because change is a coming. Something is going to happen just like that. It's going to be instant. It may bring a new person into your life, which I think it's going to do. There's going to, I, I think it's going to reunite you with somebody. Could be an air sign, Gemini. Could be a Gemini, could be a Libra, could be an Aquarius. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, <laughs> the biggest message I get from this reading is there is going to be rapid change. Drastic change is coming. And it could reunite you with a soulmate connection. This is not who you think it is. You've been carrying a heavy burden, a heavy load. That's something that needs to be dropped that has left you feeling emotionally drained. Maybe even sick and ill. Something, and I think that you know that it needs to be released, but you haven't released it. And now the universe is saying the time is now. I'm going to bring you somebody to help you. Destined change is on the horizon. Because you haven't been getting the love that you deserve. And you deserve to be a love. You don't do... You, you, you deserve to be loved. You don't deserve to have to do it all on your own. You deserve this partner. You deserve this true love. In the end, there is going to be a celebration... You could also be dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. There's definitely some sort of heartache. There's some sort of grieving process that you may go through. When somebody gets cut out of your life, it does cause grief. 
So I believe that there is going to be some sort of grieving that may cause you to go within. It may make you ask some questions, you know, why, 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 why? But in the end, it will, it will be considered a gift. It will be with this Three of Cups. There's definitely some very fast, quick changes coming for you that are going to probably cause you some pain. But in the end, it's going to move you in a better direction. It's going to bring you something much better with the Wheel of Fortune. It's going to change your course for the better. It's destined to happen and it's going to bring you a soulmate connection. Whether it's a love connection, a friendship connection, whatever it is, it's going to bring you something that is better suited for you. Instead of leaving you all alone in the darkness, carrying on this burden of life by yourself. So Aries, I you know, I feel like there's an opportunity that is being let go of. This it's really not an opportunity, it's an offer. It's it's a it's a feeling, it's a loss, okay? There's some sort of letting go of something that you have been reluctant to let go of and as you let go of it, whether you like it or not, the universe is going to remove something, okay? They are they're going to remove something and bring something better to you. You've been resisting this release for quite some time. You have. You've been re resisting this release. And it's been causing you emotional withdrawal, you know. You, you haven't been getting the love, the love that you deserve. And it's like the divine, because this is a divine connection, it's like the universe or God or whatever has, has seen you suffering and now they want to bring you some help. And the only way to bring this help in is to cause some sort of breakdown to bring this help into your life. You know, they got to do something drastic here to get you to wake up. So I think that there's a drastic change on the heart. Be prepared for the unexpected. Expect the unexpected, Aries. Expect the unexpected. There is something going to happen very quickly, suddenly. Okay? Suddenly, suddenly, suddenly. Quick, 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 quick. Okay? Something is going to happen that moves you in a better direction. It's not something that you can predict. It's going to happen... <laughs> out of the blue okay and it's going to it's going to hurt it's going to cause some pain it's going to cause some grief but in the end it's going to be something to celebrate because it's going to bring you something better it may cause you to go within for a little while and ask a bunch of questions you know why this happened blah 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 the whole nine yards but in the end it's going to be a gift it's something to celebrate this fell out attraction you attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully you know i'm not sure that you're gonna enjoy this moment fully but it's gonna bring you something that is gonna help you to heal love heals somebody is coming to help you heal whether you like it or not Oh my God. What did I just say? Somebody is coming to help you heal. 
Let your friends help you. Ask for and accept support from others. I'm telling you what. Help is arriving for you. Courtesy of the universe. You're going to, I think that you may experience some sort of pain that really hurts, okay? But it's going to it's going to unite you with a soulmate. Oh my god. Oh god, I got the I got the goosebumps so bad. The union of hearts there is a connection of love that defies explanation. I wish that you could see them. They're coming even stronger now. There is. Okay? You have a new soulmate connection coming up that defies explanation. It's meant to happen at this time. It's going to be a blessing in disguise. Whatever happens is... For one thing, you can't... You can't predict it, okay? It's it's unpredictable. And it's not it's not who you think it is, okay? It's somebody that you don't that you like I said, it's unpredictable. So there's a there's a soulmate connection coming out coming about for you that is unexplainable. Get ready. Somebody's coming to help. Good luck. <laughs>